Hey, it's Brickzar. We're going to look at one of the new sets. Um, I couldn't resist this set. Um, I'm a big fan of dumpsters, and especially dumpsters on fire. And so I'm going to build this set, and I'm going to bore you all with some conversation while I build it. But um, this is just one of these little sets with a minifigure, a motorcycle, and a dumpster. Set 60,000, fire mo motorcycle, 40 pieces. <clears throat> It's good that you can put out fires with a motorcycle. So um, I was ri riding around with a fire extinguisher. That's good. But um, so it was 40 pieces and a sticker. So hopefully it won't take long to build. But um, it's got a nice little red motorcycle frame. Here's the instruction manual. It's got the shouting kit again. There's your parts list. Lego City. Lego.com city, there's all the city I main city sets. I love all the vehicles they make. Um, the buildings I'm still not crazy about, but um, you yeah, know, hey, it's Lego. So, anyway, this ought to be hopefully an easy set to build. I don't know, I always struggle even with Duplo sets. So. That's motorcycle helmets. When I was a kid, the motorcycles, I mean the helmets for whatever character, whether it's space, motorcycle, police, whatever, the, the helmets would always break, but they make them a lot better now. So that's the motorcycle fire. I did not know fire departments used motorcycles. That's new to me. Usually get an extra visor with a set, just as you usually get extra cheese. That's what I call those um, one by one slopes. Um, it's got a yellow fire extinguisher. I'm not sure. I guess that's for fire, not for electrical. That was easy to build. All right, now we we'll go to the motorcycle frame. Use these pneumatic. These are actually pneumatic T. You can use these in those pneumatic sets, which they don't seem to make as much anymore. How does that go? Does it go like that? All right. I love the motorcycle wheels. Anyway, <clears throat> I do like dumpsters. I do collect sets that have dumpsters in them. Uh, my first job, actually it's not my first job, it was my one, two, third job. My third job was working at a theme park called Six Flags Over Georgia. And I used to have to go in there and jump on the dumpsters to get the trash to fit in. How does this go? Alright, it goes up. It's got to go over that. I think that's got to go in the front. Oh, there it is. Clicks on right there. Let's see if I do it right. Oh, I did that wrong. See, y'all were probably, somebody's watching this going, oh, you're doing it wrong. But hey, what do you expect? I'm a guy who worked in the dumpster business. So yeah, that's how it goes. So yeah, anyway, I, that was my job, working in the dumpsters. All right, they work now. All right, 6,000, 60,000. So that's the way they do on these sets, is usually the number of the vehicle is the number of the set. So I think that one goes on this side. Yep. I, I pushed dumpsters out when the park would close at Six Flags. They'd, we'd have to, they had dumpsters on wheels back then, they didn't have trash compactors, and we'd have to push the dumpsters from the different areas to where the dumpster truck could get to them. It was always a lot of fun, especially when you had to push them uphill. So usually they made it where the, if they were loaded, you were going downhill anyway. But, um, loads of fun. Anything any other 16 year old would want to be doing. Stepping on dumpsters and pushing dumpsters, picking up trash, that's what I did. And then later, when we worked at night there, you have to uh, kind of 
make sure you had a checklist to let the dumpster man know which dumpsters to uh, empty. Because I put this piece on wrong. And um, he wrote us a note one night, the dumpster man. It was kind of funny because he spelled words wrong. I thought his name was Derver, but that's the way he spelled driver. It was Derver. We created a whole new language based on that one short letter he wrote. So yeah, I did some dumpster work. And they had, um, the Six Flags, they had a little stand one time where um, you could get your picture made and they had these cutouts on plywood and it had a photograph on the plywood but the cutout was cut out the shape of a different actor or celebrity. And you could, um, this yellow piece goes here, get your photo made. Well, when they got worn out, they just throw them in the dumpster. And some buddies of mine went in there and got them out of the dumpster. So we had the, all these cutouts. I had the Arnold Schwarzenegger. I had, um, was that girl on Beverly Hills, 90210, Shannon Doherty. I had Christy, no, not Christy, um, Cindy Crawford. So that was pretty neat. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself here. I can't talk and build. So I've gotten my share of stuff out of the dumpster before. I think the statute of limitations is over for any of that stuff. If we did anything that was inappropriate. So here's the other brown piece. And nothing smells worse than the Coke syrup. It's been sitting all day in the hot sun and then put in the dumpster. Let me tell you, that is one nasty smell. We called it spooge. That juice that's at the bottom of the trash can. All right, there's that part of the dumpster. So I feel, I did that job for a long time and I feel that I paid my dues. So I don't feel like I'm a lucky person. I don't even believe in luck for one thing, but um, sometimes people think I'm lucky. I'm not lucky, I work hard. Did I do that right? Does that look right? Is that the lip hanging over? Oh, I forgot, we gotta put it on fire. <laughs> See the big fire goes there. You know, I even went in the dumpster one time, and that is it. Look at all the extra pieces you get. I went in the dumpster one time to get somebody's retainer, and I found it. I went into the dumpster to get somebody's keys and found them. It's almost nothing that anybody could lose on a tray at Six Flags and accidentally throw it in the dumpster that I couldn't find. And probably all the diseases out there, it probably wouldn't be a good idea to do that today because I didn't even use gloves. But hey, I was a kid. So anyway, that's my boring story while I build the Fire Motorcycle Set 60,000. Man, it's cool. You can, all these extra pieces you get. So many extra pieces, I thought I built it wrong. But you can't go wrong, wrong with a dumpster. You get a cool motorcycle. I guess I'll show you the minifigure. That's your fire dude. Very cool. Uh oh. Sorry. Here's your motorcycle. Did not know that fire departments use motorcycles, and there's the dumpster. It's on fire! And that's, that's it. 40 piece set. So, anyway, thanks for watching Brickzar. Sorry I went a little long on this, but um, just wanted to bore you with a story about my life working at Six Flags. Please comment, like, and subscribe.